Hi guys, Kirk and Jay here with Kirk Giordano Plastery. Today I just want to address a question that gets asked of me often. And I get all kind of slurs by saying, hey, what kind of real plaster uses a swimming pool trowel? Back 30, 35 years ago when we did swimming pools, we'd use these swimming pool trowels because you'd get no joints. Well, I got kind of fond of it and I've been using them ever since, at least 30 years. Uh, I'm going to show you guys something. Back <coughs> now, you might, you look at these two trowels and they look like perfect swimming pool trowels, but they aren't. Um, they're not perfect radius trowels. Say like this one here, this trowel here. This is a Congo trowel. It's a big one. It's a 20 by 5. I don't, I don't expect anybody to use these right here. They're kind of big to handle, but I like it. Notice, I, what I did is I squared this off. Now only this part is square and this part is square or straight. And only the ends have the radius where, say for example, here is a perfect swimming pool trowel. Now notice the radius on this. The radius is a full radius. So this trowel, the one I use, doesn't have a full radius. This is the one I generally use. It's a 16 by 5. Now, I recommend any of you guys who just started in the trade use a 12 by 5. These Marshall Towns or Curries are perfect. You don't need to use a trowel like Kirk. I just kind of like this and back when I was Union I would take a trowel, a swimming pool trowel because they didn't have them too straight like this and I would take my chop saw and I would leave a little bit of the radius on just the corners and I'd chop it with a steel blade and I'd file it down and that's I used to like that but now I can buy these on bond tools um, where they have more of the more of the uh, straight edge and I like the straight edge because it it, when I'm going this way here, it won't leave it too wiggly. They're generally used for, again, swimming pools or interior finishes where you're doing taping mud and you don't want any joints. Uh, so again, you see that right there. Only the ends, this a little bit of straight here where if I took, if I took this nasty little swimming pool trial, it's rusty because I hardly ever use it, and I put it here. Now, that is a full radius. It, continues to go around guys and again just because I use this trowel here guys doesn't mean any of you guys got to use it stick with these uh, square ones if that's what makes you happy again this is 12 by 5 I recommend for all you new guys 12 by 5 I use a 16 by 5 if I'm using uh, a square one for the walls but generally I stick with this 16 by 5 anyway I thought I, I told a fellow I'd answer that question because he says where do you get those full radiuses? And I thought, damn, now you're complicating things. It is not a full radius. It looks like it, but it's not a full radius. So again, uh, I'm not saying this for you guys to buy these swimming pool trials with a straight edge, but I'm pointing out what I use, guys. If it makes you happy, buy whatever tool you want. If you want to use your shoe, use your shoe. You don't have to do what Kirk does. I just, I do these videos and I'm fond of my tools, so I'm gonna keep using them. Anyway, guys, I wanted to point that out. My name is Kirk. Jason on the camera, we thank you for watching it as usual. We'll see you guys on the next one. Once again, folks, we thank you for watching and I really enjoy all your comments. If you guys like this video, please click the like button down below. And also, if you enjoy what we do, subscribe to our channel so we can keep making these videos for you. My name is Kirk. And Jay. We thank you for watching. And from the entire Giordano family, we'll, we'll see you on the next one.